my uh, uh, Instagram and YouTube family, let me carry the go. Let me go and see the man and the boys. You know, before I found that they are crying of hungry. You know, my big men that they be feeding. I'm feeding them for food because, you know, my children are mixed race and there's a very big possibility that they go marry also uh, different backgrounds. Indian, um, Asian, uh, uh, how you say it, Muslim, Caucasian, different. So I want to make sure that they are strong because you never know. And if they want to marry African, there's also a very big possibility because they love this African mama that Jesus gave them. There's a very big possibility that they want to marry an African woman. I want them to make sure that they have strong hands on wedding day. They carry woman with full power because their papa almost dropped me. But anyway, let's not laugh at him because I was pregnant. I was already less than six months pregnant, five months pregnant. How are you? How are you? Thank you. So... I want to make sure that they are strong because when their papa lifted me, he was Dutch. They gave him potato, but he never had fufu. He couldn't carry me. But my people, they pardoned him because I was pregnant. And we tested it after the baby was born. The man could carry me. That's why I feed him fufu now. So that, if, in fact, if we go back to Zambia next time, sister, <laughs> in case my family want to see Papa Rokafer and lift me again, they were laughing at him how we neck almost fell out. This time I want them to see that I've been feeding him fufu. I've been giving him shima, ugari, saza. He got left me. So in-laws, don't worry. The sons I'm raising, they go have mass in the in the hands. Praise the Lord. They go have brain and vein. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. They will let's carry the Idris. I'm never. <laughs> let's carry the go. I'll see you people by the way and the grace of God. Bye-bye, my TikTok family. Let's move in the way of God. Beverly and Sharon, I don't see you. Why are you not talking? <laughs> In fact, before we close, please let's remember to help feed out the need, please. This afternoon, I had to help somebody, and it's so sad. I had to, to refuse for one person and help one person. Please, my brothers and sisters, Sharon and Beverly, with me, I am fine. The Lord has got me. You never have to worry about me with headache. Please. Let's remember the people who don't have I'm begging you. There are a lot of people who still need that help. Let's not forget about it. Because those people, if we forget about them, it's when our friends start going back now doing wrong things because they were desperate for money. Please, my sisters, remember me. Help me out to feed the need. I will appreciate that. And God bless all of you. Let's close. Let me let me close this thing. Bye-bye, everybody. Bev, Sharon, and everybody. I love all of you. God bless all of you. And I'll see you people tomorrow by the way and the grace of God. Bye-bye. Hey, what?